conquers the Dragon Emperor. Okay. Jill breaks out of prison the night before she's set to be executed by her fiancé, Crown Prince Gerald. She's... Uh, She's struck by an arrow while, while escaping, but instead of dying, she's transported six years into the past, to the night she and Gerald met. Desperate to alter fate, she instead proposes to the first man she sees, Hades Tales Rave, her enemy in the future. This is her last chance to get it right. Okay, so this is kind of like, um, uh... It's kind of like a bit of a Ryliana, uh, mixed with a bit of a... Dr. Elise, I suppose. Well, no, it's it's more like a Ryliana mixed with uh, Tear Moon Empire. That's more like it, yeah. She uh, goes back in time, gets another chance, and uh, yeah, let's let's check out the trailer. I have had my eye on this show for quite a while, actually. Ever since I uh, found, I guess I found out later that I guess I had my eye on this before I found out that it was being done by JC staff but um, let's take a look at this trailer Man, JC Staff's animation! Goodness me! Hey! Look at him, like, cooking. この皇帝は悪い男じゃ。本気か。私に二号はない。君で that look that looked pretty good actually i did like uh that that looks quite interesting that looks uh quite entertaining it'll be interesting to see um the interactions between uh, the protagonist and the um, Dragon Emperor, as it says here. So yeah, I I am looking forward to this one. This will be a this will be a nice one, I think, to watch. A nice. I guess I kind of like these. These fantasies are more interesting to me now. These kind of shows appeal to me now. You know, the sort of romance fantasies heroine shows you know rather than you know oh i was the i was the weakest of my party but i was secretly the strongest you know like those are just you know just don't really have my attention as more 